Hearts Police Department is moving forward. This is a proud, proud moment. As part of major changes taking place within BART Police, the Transit District held a reception to dedicate this new office space at its Oakland headquarters. The office will be home to the district's first ever independent police auditor. This is real. The BART Board and this organization stood up and said, we have to do something differently. Creation of the Independent Auditor's Office comes as a result of the tragic officer-involved shooting of passenger Oscar Grant on January 1st, 2009. Legislation creating the Auditor's Office was made possible through the efforts of Oakland Assembly member Sandra Swanson. Well, thank you very much for this. As part of the opening of the offices, Bart presented Swanson with this plaque honoring his efforts. I think this is all about uh, restoring public confidence and the fact that the Bart Board of Directors uh, aggressively pursued the legal authorization to be able to set up citizen review and a, a police auditor's office uh, is a compliment to the board. Bart Board member Carol Ward-Allen Cheers the BART Citizens Oversight Committee. If somebody comes forth and they have a complaint, the complaint will come to, you know, the auditor will, uh, his office will be the first one that will deal with this issue. And then from there, it goes up the food chain. And if it needs to come all the way to the uh, BART Board of Directors, then it will do so. The creation of the Independent Auditor's Office is just one of many efforts underway to improve BART's police, including the hiring of new BART Police Chief Kenton Rainey as well as increased officer visibility on trains. And building trust and establishing long-lasting partnerships with the communities BART serves. Cheryl Stalter, BART TV News.